guys were back this week. Unfortunately, we had a little sad moment. We realized our bees have varroa mites, which we have to treat for this week. And we're also going to do a little bit of a treatment for uh, nosema, which is a parasite that can affect the bees. So let's get suited up and treat these bees. Alright, so we got our sugar water here. It's a one-to-one -one ratio and we're using a gallon container. Um, and then we're going to do one teaspoon of our treatment for our bees. And then we're going to mix it up a little bit. And this is going to treat the nosema. And then we'll show you what we'll do for the mites after. Okay, we're going to put it in a measuring cup just so it's a little bit easier to feed to the bees. Okay, let's go feed the bees. So we have our uh, Nosema treatment water with the uh, sugar water. And then we're going to put them in our little soy sauce dishes. And they have rocks in them. This is so that the bees won't drown when they're um, flying into the water and also drinking it. So they have like a safe spot to land, kind of. So we'll fill these ones up. And then we just leave them right outside the hive and the bees will come and drink up all the water and then we'll replace it once there is no water left in it. All right guys, so now I'm gonna show you uh, how we look for mites. We have the bottom board here and we're just gonna take it out. And upon inspection, the other day we did see a couple of small mites. It might be a little bit hard to see you with the camera. We will include a photo um, of what you are looking for. But you can see up in here, little mite. And before we replace the bottom board into the hive, we want to give it a little bit of a clean off just so next time we check, we're not looking at the same mites that we've already seen um, and we kind of get a fresh start there. So I'm just gonna go in with the hive tool, clear it off as best as I can. The bottom board can get a little sticky because it is lots of pollen and little honey crystals and such falling off. So it does get a little bit sticky down there. We'll just do our best to get what we can off. And then we're gonna put it right back in. Now let's go into the hive and treat for some mites. Okay, so we have our mite strip here. We're gonna take out one of the frames so we can move a few of them back and put it in where their brood cells are. They haven't started on this one at all. So we'll just lay it off to the side. And move them back. And then they have these um, handy little tabs that'll sit on top of the frame. We'll push this one back in so it can sit nicely. Pull this frame up and let you guys have a little peek on what's going on here. So we can look in there, see what the honeybees are up to. Let's see if we can spot the queen, maybe not on this frame. They're looking pretty happy and healthy to me. back in here. Make sure they're nice and close to each other.
right, we got the hive reassembled here. We're going to leave them be for a little while, but we will be checking in on the bottom board just to see how many mites are falling, if the um, mite strip is working, which I'm sure it will be. Uh, we will be leaving that mite strip in for about 42 days, and then after that uh, we will check in not as regularly, but definitely keeping an eye just to see if those mites end up being a problem again, and then we will look at other treatment options for our bees. And we will be feeding the sugar water to the bees until they are finished the one gallon. So I had a friend bet me that we, you couldn't pet bees. And so we tried it a couple times now and they're totally fine with it. So we're taking video evidence to prove it wrong. I gotta wait for them to be still and be drinking. There he is. Okay, here we go. Ready? Let's hope I don't get stung. Anybody? Hi, buddy. Mm, you're chilly. Hi. Hey, buddy. Aren't you a good little bee, huh? Aren't you a good little bee? Aren't you a good little bee? So cute. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to hit like and subscribe below and we'll be back next week with a little update. Bye!